WTFNN. Headline News Update. Okay, folks, Larry Pesavento, mid-afternoon update for TFNN. Uh, we were a little bit higher in stocks earlier, and now we're slightly lower. Very little change, actually. The Dow was down about 120, I think. S&P was down 14 or 15, but that's very little. we got something to talk about uh, regarding that uh, situation when we have our show coming up here in just about another uh, six minutes. But I did want to mention... Uh, the bond market is still going higher. We're up now seven handles from the bottom down at that 107 level. And the second thing that you got to remember is, is the Federal Reserve will be speaking today. I don't know which of the dudes are out there, but I think it's uh, uh, Jerome is going to be speaking. I call these folks by their first name because we're so very close. And maybe Lyle Blannard will be talking. And uh, anyway, we'll find out if they do anything. <laughs> we won't worry too much about it. Gold is still going down. And uh, what else? silver is still going down. But it's it's uh, bottomed a little bit. It's actually shown a tiny bit of strength earlier in the morning that gave it back up. The big news is the fact that the U.S. dollar has weakened. And that causes a weakening in the uh, gold and the metals also. So they're all moving down in the right direction. Our guest today will be Mike Moore of Moore Analytics. And if you remember here, we've had him on here about uh, 10 days ago, and he was quite bearish on the crude oil complex. And uh, we hit $75 a barrel today, folks. What happened to these dudes who were telling us it was going to go to 100 and 120? Hello, operator. Follow the charts, folks. They're not going to lie to you very often. It's the one thing they can't do. They can give you misinformation they can lie to you they can tell you things that aren't true which is basically a lie give you data that doesn't really mean anything or is false but if you got the chart in front of you if there's more buying prices are going up if there's more selling prices are going down that's really all you're trying to do when you're looking at these markets and sometimes you're going to have a big winner sometimes you're going to have a loser keep your losers as small as you can and the winners are going to come up, and they're going to make you a lot of money. All you got to do is be right about 50% of the time, and we can do better than 50%. So let's keep that in mind. We've got some things to talk about, so stay with us, 877-927-6648. Everything in 